the Go Play Crew. Hey guys, come join the Go Play Crew and subscribe to our channel. And if you could like and share our videos, that would be awesome. Now let's go play. Hey guys, what are you doing? You playing with a dinosaur? Yeah. What do you got over there, Owen? You got some dinosaurs? Well, guess what today is? What? Today is Mystery Craft Day. So check this out. We'll set this one here and guess what? We got another one. We have two Mystery Crafts. We'll set one here and we'll set one here. And are we ready? Uh -huh. Let's do it. All right, let's see what we got for today's craft. What do we got here? A dinosaur skull excavation kit. Wow. And Owen, we got one here. Let's see what we got for our mystery craft. You got one here, buddy. Oh, man. What do we got on for your mystery craft? A dinosaur eggs in a tin self-hatching. All righty. Let's check them out. So, you remember you got this at the end of the Dino Quest when we saw the dinosaurs at the zoo. And so check out our video, Dinosaurs Invade the Zoo, where we see lifelike dinosaurs moving. Do you remember all the dinosaurs that were there? What was your favorite dinosaur? Um, the Paracephalophus. The Paracephalophus? Wow, okay, that's his favorite. Usually like the T-Rex. The T-Rex is always the, 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 the big one, isn't he? Yeah, it, it can be Triceratops. That's right. They're well, we, we won't tell them who was battling who and what, but there was some cool stuff at the zoo, hey. right? Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. There's one of four skulls buried in this excavation yeah, kit. Right, right. You can either get the Tyrannosaurus, the Pechiocephalosaurus, the Triceratops, or the I Stegosaurus. Which one do you think it's going to be? You do like, that's your favorite, but we'll see. Those are all cool. We'll see what comes in it. Let's open it up. Looks like he's got a big piece of earth. I mean, no, we, gotta, we gotta chisel away at that thing. So let's see what else we got. All right, we got a stand to put our dinosaur skull when we're done with it. We'll keep this in here. And then we got some excavation tools. Pretty simple. A little brush. And it looks like we got two picks. And let's open it. And let's do it. Two, we got dinosaurs in a tin, self-hatching. Put the egg in a container and fill it with water <coughs> and see them hatch. Yeah, and here I we go. We got two eggs. Happy. All right. Let's open them up. Let's see. Those are pretty cool. Just hold them. All right. Hand one to Owen. Um, I'm giving that one. All right. Um. All right, Owen. You ready to put your egg in here? Put the egg in there. Put it in there. All right, put it in. Put it in, put it in, put it in. All right, here we go. One, two, woo! Oh no, all right. Let's make sure he's all the way down. Let's get them both going. All right. Let's go ahead and push it in so it gets submerged and dip until it's all the way down. Keep it all right. And you know what? We're just gonna leave it right here. Let's get to work now. We got both our eggs hanging out there. You're hanging out with your Spinosaurus. So you know what this is when you carve like archaeologists when they find fossils trapped in the earth and mud and stone. They have to slowly peel it away. You're chipping away. And then look, I think we're starting to see something. So we gotta keep slowly picking away. And because the fossils are delicate, that's why they use brushes. You move the brush and see, look, you start, you start, you're right. And you, that's, that is part of it.
Oh man, that's, that's exciting. And maybe that. this piece of tool, see, look, gets in here. That's what archeologists have to use, really tiny tools and be patient so they don't hurt the fossil that's been trapped for millions of years. Look at that. <laughs> look, I see fossil coming out. We're finding all through here, man. Look at that. And then let's check out the eggs. Eggs? They're not doing much yet. They're still there, not ready to hatch. Piece here. Oh, oh man. Uh-oh. We're so close, we're getting so close. Whoa! Whoa, man. Oh, it's a T-Rex. Is that what you think it is? Yeah. I don't even know what that is. Whoa, man, that's cool. I don't even know what side we're on yet. Big piece off here. Ooh, this is so big. You no, know, they take a long time to excavate sometimes. That's why you appreciate how long it takes, huh? Because look how long it's taken us. Can you imagine digging up a whole dinosaur? You know how long that would take? Yeah, 50 minutes. A long time. That I see teeth and a nose. Get the brush. Oh my goodness. I think we have a T Rex. Let's get them all the way out of there. Brush them up. Look what we have so far, Gavin. We're almost there. Yeah. Look at that. And now that's where the detailing comes in. We gotta slowly get up. You know what they also use? Uh -huh. And this will make it quicker now. We can get this part, water. You gently move some water and that'll be fun. Yeah. All right, check this out. Now we're close and we're gonna do some fine detailing. So I say we just use our brushes. So go ahead and dip them in there and let's get them all cleaned up. All right. Oh, wow. Let's put a mush in there to see. Dipping it and moving stuff around. I gotta shake it like this. Let's see what we got. You getting them cleaned up? You keep moving it around. Here, you do it and I'll hold it, ready? Mm -hmm. All right. Brush off that stuff. That look. Then you got a person in his mouth like this. Yeah, and you know they can eat a lot. You know what we need to do? Uh -huh. We need to brush his teeth. Yeah. Do you know why? Because uh -huh. if you don't brush your teeth, what happens? You get cavities. Uh -huh. So let's brush his teeth. Oh brush man. Do, do, brush, your teeth, do, do. brush your teeth. All right. And we have got a T Rex on our hands. All right. We rinsed them off one last time. Are you ready to see the final T Rex? Here it is. So we uncovered it T Rex. Skull. Yeah, it looks awesome. It does look awesome. You know what's cool? It has a stand. So you know what we can do? Okay. Let's clean all this up and then we'll get them ready for the stand. We have the stick. You can put it on the bottom here. Yeah. And then we have the base. And so it actually says Tyrannosaurus on the base, but we kept that a secret. We didn't want to look at it until. So you got it on the head. Alrighty, that's yeah. there. And then put the head on it. Oh, holy Whoa, there's still water and stuff from excavating. We have to wipe them down. Yeah. All righty. And that's it. Uh-huh. Look at that. Let's put it in a toy room. We'll put it in a toy room? Uh -huh. You got all dinosaurs in your toy room. All right. Back it down, and now it looks yeah, like you I just walked in a museum. It could go in a museum. Yeah, I just walked in a museum. That's really cool. So now we know what it takes when they find the dinosaur fossils uh -huh. in the mud. Yeah, you mean you do it. You dig in there for a hundred years. Dig a long time. 
long time and we gotta slowly rinse it and then clean it all up and wipe it and then you put it on display and that's what it takes we and have, wipe it we wiped it down yeah. guys gotta be gentle with the dinosaur fossils hey, it's dinosaurs over here. Hey. hey what's what dinosaur is this Spinosaurus. What dinosaur is that? Rockosaurus. Rockosaurus. And then what do we get from our Dino Quest adventure? A T Rex fossil skull. Yeah. So check this out. Our yeah. eggs, they're starting to crack a little bit, yeah. but they're not ready to come out. So you know what? Yeah. We're going to have to wait. Oh, I know. So, what kind of dinosaurs do you think are going to be in here? I don't know. I don't know either. You know, Owen? We'll see. So you know, you know what we'll do? Let's let's leave them alone and we'll go to sleep and wake up tomorrow. We'll see if they've hatched. All right, man. We just woke up and Gavin wanted to check out the eggs. And they still haven't came out yet, but it looks like they're almost there. Yeah. How much I longer? Just, I Minutes. Yeah, but uh, we might have to wait. We're gonna wait a little longer, but the they're home. right there, and we still don't know yeah. what they're gonna be. I don't know what they're gonna be. All right, we'll we'll come back and check them out they tonight. All right, grab which one you want. Okay, this one. That one, okay. And I'm gonna grab this one. Let's help him out of this egg. You gonna help him out? Uh, what do you think it is? You gonna hatch them? What do you got? That, to me, looks like a triceratops. And you know what you have? Ah! That's a stegosaurus. He has no tail. He doesn't have a tail yet. Maybe he's still growing. Oh, there's his tail on the side, see? My tail. Right there's a tail. Oh, they're like bouncing around. They're squishy, aren't they? <laughs> <laughs> They're soft and squishy. They hatch. <laughs> All right, let's, let's see the camera. Let's see. It. Let's see if we got Stegosaurus and a Triceratops. After a whole day, it took them to hatch. Pretty fun, huh? Yeah. If the girl like who? Hey guys, guess what time it is? We're doing a mystery craft. The mystery craft for today. Dino soap. All right. Dino soap, let's do it. All right, let's hear it. Look, we got some, we got molds. Look at all these molds. Dino molds everywhere. Look. Look at that. Big bag of soap. More yeah, soap. Whoa. Look at all these colors. And the mixing. All right. Ooh. Here we go. Set it here. What kind of dinosaurs we have? What's this? Brachiosaurus. That's a T Rex? No, I don't know what that is. T Rex, what do you think that is? that? Triceratops. What do you got over here, Alan? Stegosaurus. Stegosaurus. And then what's he got way over here? Yeah, wow, so we got because the T Rex is a king eater. Yeah, he, it's, yes, right. You know what? That's the king of the, the king of the dinosaurs. All right, Ellen. And we got glitter to make our soap glittery. All right, and then last but not least, we have two fragrances. We got green apple and lemon to make our soap smell. Lemons are sour. You're right about that. All right, you all wants to check out the fragrance. Make sure they smell good. Okay. Let's get the party started, man. Here we go. We're gonna put some soap in there. Go ahead and throw it in there. All right, is that good? Oh yeah, okay. Look at all that soap. They're like a whole pile. All righty. We're gonna put this in the microwave and melt it. In here for about 20 seconds. That's gonna take forever, Dad. Let's do it. This is like the scoop driver. Dun, 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 no. All right. <laughs> all righty, we're done. Here it is. Let's add some color. Now you look color. You want to do yellow? Yellow. All right. Oh, a bunch of color in there. Okay, stir it up. Be careful. You, you stir it up. It's going to be a little warm. Now I'll add some more yellow in there for you. Oh, it's going to be bright yellow. You want a little glitter? 
Let's put a little get glitter. Keep stirring it up. All right. Look at that. Get it in there. And then, you know what? We got lemon, smelly lemon in there. Sprinkles. Is it all good? You want to do the T-Rex? Mm -hmm. Okay. Pour a little bit on top. We'll put a little bit there. And then pick another dinosaur. So, which another dino? All right, you want to pour it in? All right, pour it in. Squeeze it a little bit and pour it right in this hole. I'm so scared. I know, pour it in there. You got this. Yeah, all right, let's do a little more. You got it. Good job. All right, let's, let's, save, let's save some yellow for another dinosaur. Okay. Now, let's try another color. All right, all right. You put a lot of green in there. Mm -hmm. uh, let's do a little bit on top of the Stegosaurus. Here we go. Whoa, just a half. And then a little bit for the T-Rex. Oh, the way. You want some of his tail? Right there. Does that look good? Um, no. Okay. All right. You know what? You got a Brachiosaurus, and that's the Brachiosaurus. We'll see it when he comes out. And you got a T Rex, and there's a T Rex there. No, that's not a T Rex. What is that? Remember? This is a Gigantosaurus. I, I, I love Gigantosaurus. All right, here we go. We're going to pour a little green in. Whoa, right there. Look at that. Mm. And then a little here. All the way, a little bit. All right. Does that look good? Yeah. We'll put a, more, a little more here. Okay, let's get another color. Oh, look at that bright red. What smell do you want to add? Um, apple. All right, keep stirring it. Oh, you want to squeeze the apple in? Okay. Squeeze the apple in. All right, let's do some gold. All right, that looks good. Great job. All right, stir it up. All right, does that look good? That looks good to me. All right, let's bring out, we're gonna, we got the Stegosaurus that's got some green. It looks like we got the Triceratops. Mm -hmm. Some red in there. Oh yeah, I have my wow. legs back. And then some red here. Yeah, I have my legs back. We'll just go all the way on this one. How about that? Pow. Let's get the next dinosaurs. All right, some for the Brachiosaurus all the way up. And do this guy kind of all the way up. And, get one. and then a little bit left for this guy. And that means we can do another color for him. Any color you want to do. So this one, this one was already done, so we'll leave this one here. And this one we'd fill up all the way, so we'll leave those two there. And that one was done. All right, so we just have these two left. What color do you want to finish it up with? Um, Pick your color. And our last one, yellow. That's gonna look so cool. All the way to the top, whoa, man. Okay, and, oh man, look at that go. Look at that glitter. You know how cool that's gonna be when no. that's done? All right. Let's open them up and see. Oh man, whoa. You know what that looks like to me? It looks like a triceratops, here's your tool. Look, you know, big You know what's cool about this? It looks messy, but this is all soap. Mm -hmm. We'll just use water and our hands will be squeaky clean. Hey, Dad, I can't put this in the bathroom. Oh, that's right. So we're going to put it, we're going to wash our hands. And a little bit there. Yeah. There it is. And the second one. Look at that. That looks like a T-Rex. And look at the Bronchiosaurus. He's got out. Peel him up. <laughs> All right, looking cool. Brachiosaurus through his top. Isn't that cool? Look at that. Huh? That's With the like, glitter? Yeah. Man. That's our okay. <laughs> That's awesome. We'll set that one there. Bye. All right, let's pop out this last one. Here we go. Here's the popper outer. Oh, that might be the coolest one. Yeah. Whoa. Hey, look. He, he rolled away. Yeah, he did. Now look at that. All right, here's our parade of dinosaurs. We have a Stegosaurus, a T-Rex, a Brachiosaurus, another Stegosaurus, a Gigantosaurus, 
a Triceratops, and another Brachiosaurus. All right, Dinosaur Soak. It's the Girl Play Crew. <laughs> hey, guys. What? Guess what we have today? The Mystery Craft. And this, this was a little hint. Yeah. What do you think it's going to be? Let's check it out and see what we got for today's mystery craft. All right. Let's see what we got. All right. What do you got here? Let's check it out. This says... Create with clay dinosaurs. It says cover three dinosaur fossils with clay and play. What's up, man? So let's see, it says, comes with three dinosaurs, a T-Rex, a Stegosaurus, and a Triceratops. Yeah. Look how cool that is. And yeah, colors too. It says bring three, all kind of colors. It says bring three dinosaurs. too, Dad. That's what it shows. We'll have to open up and see. Yeah. You know what? Mm -hmm. It says wiggly eyes. Mm -hmm. You're right. Clay tools. Five blocks of clay. Three dinosaur fossils. And the all important instructions. Oh, man. What, Dad? There we go. The googly eyes. All right. Let's set this here. So we can look at it. Maybe it can help us. So, this are the skeleton fossils. Mm -hmm. Go ahead, you open them up and take them out. I'll get the tools out. And then look what's on the other side. Look at those bright colors. Clay. I've never played with clay before. Have you played with clay? Uh -huh. You have? Uh -huh. well, then you can show me how to do it. Wow, look at that. And all the colors. Let's yeah. do one. All right, what color is this? Purple. Purple. And what color is this? Red. Red. And this. Yellow. And this color. Green. And the last one. Blue. All right, man, some colorful stuff here. Blue. What dinosaur is this? Triceratops. Triceratops. And then what dinosaur is that? T-Rex. T-Rex, you're right. And then what kind of sword is this? Stegosaurus. You are correct, sir. Which one do you want to design? Um, you pick one. This one. Do you want the mighty T-Rex? All right, Ellen. <laughs> which, which dinosaur do you want? Pick one. You want the Stegosaurus? Which one? Stegosaurus? <laughs> and I'll take the try? No, you want the Triceratops? Okay. Then I got the Stegosaurus. Here's a quick fact about the dinosaurs. Tyrannosaurus rex means tyrant lizard. Uh -huh. T-Rex was the biggest meat eaters. One of the biggest meat eaters. Right. Triceratops. The meaning of Triceratops is three-horned face. Because look at that. Look at He's him. got three horns on his face. And a big Triceratops had... Yeah, no. Triceratops had nose horns that were used for defense. Stegosaurus comes from the Greek words stegos, which means roof, and source, which means lizard. They were herbivores, plant eaters. I don't know where roof lizard, why it was named roof lizard, but all right. Here's some examples. Are you ready to do it? Are you ready, Owen? Let's go. Get it all soft and then flatten it out, flatten it out. And then what you do is you slowly cover up your dinosaur. And then you get more pieces off, see? And you cover them, keep going until it's all covered, like that. Hey, a knife here. All right. You start working on that. Oh, yeah. 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 All right. Owen, do you want some clay? You start working on that blue. How about that? I'm gonna do colors too. Alright, I'm Same colors. Wait, I'm covering my dinosaur up. See? I got his head covered. No. We gotta 
put some skin on our fossils, man. Uh-huh. See? You know what's cool about this clay? Is that it's not really edible, Owen. It's not meant for eating. No, you don't want to eat that. Why? After we're done covering the dinosaurs up, we can use this clay for other stuff. Just to play with. Can you help me? Yep. What's purpose? I am the colorful T Rex. Yeah. The mighty colorful T Rex. Is it gonna be the mighty colorful one? Uh huh. A trade? You keep moving the skin around on this one, and I'm gonna start smoothing the skin on the T Rex. So keep on. <laughs> Try to cover up all Daddy. the stegosaurus. Oh, oh, oh. Look, look, Dad, look, I made. Dude, oh, that's cool, too. What are you making over there, Owen? The sightseeing. <laughs> oh, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. So you cover this leg up. You keep moving it. See, clay is meant to like you mold the clay. So you keep moving it around. So I'm gonna help Owen real quick and try to get this triceratops covered. So let's get the top covered. What do you think, Owen? Sorry. Gonna get this covered up for you. Am I doing it okay? Okay. Let me get. Some tail covered here. You're doing a good job, look at that. Getting every little piece. The Stegosaurus is almost finished, smoothed out. You almost got that one <laughs> hand done. Good job, you're almost done. And then, no. we got the Triceratops here. I still gotta get the legs. Daddy, you help me get my legs? You're almost done. Uh, Steg is um, no. almost done, and the Triceratops is almost done. <laughs> Get that purple. Why don't you tear a little two pieces off and you can put, you can make purple feet. Or you just design it however you want. <laughs> I want you molding the yellow up for us. You getting it ready for us? Hey, look, I Cause I'm gonna put, lizard. I'm gonna make yellow tops. Daddy. Okay, Daddy, you need some of that now? Lizard. Let's use some of that now. So look at, look at Owen did. He got me some yellow and I'm gonna put it on this horn. Look, on this little, I need a little little. See, look. One there. I gotta make a bunch all the way across. I'm getting ahead of myself, though, because I'm decorating my stegosaurus. But you know what? I gotta finish putting the skin on the triceratops. I'm almost done, too. Oh, right. You got you got a yellow hand. Uh, uh, uh. Okay. Oh, okay. Right. Okay. Mommy, once you finish that, mm -hmm. and then you can make it you look and it makes texture look like he's got scales and stuff. So you want to scrape your, make them nice and smooth and scale. You take that tool and do that. And then daddy, we got, we got the arms. You said you wanted yellow arms and yellow feet. For the Triosaurus, the T-Rex here. And then I'm gonna get, finish the Stegosaurus with the yellow. Yeah, I did it, I did that. That looks good. What color horns you want to put on that triceratops? We can do purple um, or yellow. Yellow. Yellow, and then we'll use purple on all of them. So there's some finishing touches. All right. We're doing a few more of these little spikies. I did it. I did it, Dad. Oh, that looks good. Roll, 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 roll. I know, and then we can play with them. <laughs> No eating the clay. All right. We're gonna roll these up. Cut one here and one here. And then let's see. We're gonna slide that horn on there. That's a big horn. We're gonna make him have giant horns. And then we're gonna slide this on there. And then a little piece will make this horn not as big. I am scraping like a mean dinosaur. All right. I'll have to smooth him out some. 
And now we got the, st we're almost there. Let's get decorating and then we'll get the googly eyes when we're all finished. Let's see, let's, let's do a little scraping for some design. And you already did your T-Rex, good. You know, let's see this, look. Remember, we can just make them fun, whatever. What if you had like little polka dots, look. Look, I'm making little balls and you stick the little balls on them like polka dots. Look, he's gonna be a, he's gonna be a polka dotted T-Rex. Look at this. Boom, just like that. Purple polka dot. Here's another one. And here's another one, a little. And polka dot here. How many more do you want? One each. Right, I'll do a couple more here. And I think I'll put, I'll put one, we'll make two little horns on the back of the Stegosaurus' his tail. We'll put two little horns in purple. And then, wait, you want to do anything with the Triceratops, or is he good? He's good. He's good. The Stegosaurus. <laughs> Alright, so we got a polka dot and T-Rex. Yeah. We got this Triceratops. Alan, are you taking Gavin's T-Rex? All right, here's what we got. All right, monster. And then we got, still got plenty of purple and yellow left. You want you want to do the googly eyes now, don't you? You can have some purple there, buddy. Oh, can I eat it? All right, and some yellow. Don't mix it, Gavin. All right, here we go. Go, get the googly eyes, you gotta be careful. All right, take, take them and put them on your dinosaur. And I'll put them on the Stegosaurus. Hey, where are my eyes? One here. You love googly eyes. <laughs> Look it. And then on the Stegosaurus. Uh-oh. One there. <laughs> And one there. There's your triceratops. Look at your look at your googly eye triceratops. Look at that. All right. Hey, tris. Hey, Stegosaurus. You want to go get? Oh no. Hey, Stegosaurus. You want to go get some lunch? Yeah. Where you want to go eat? I have a happy meal. You want a happy meal? All right. Let's go get a happy meal. Oh, hey, there's Triceratops. Well, hey, guys. Where are you all going? Happy Meal. Happy Meal? I want a Happy Meal. Yeah. Let's go. All right. Let's get a Happy Meal. All right. Happy Yay. Back. Tearing his skin back off. He's getting a fossil. What are you doing over there, Alan? We have a box here full of stuff. Are you ready? All right, this is what we got. We got a box and show them what we got. We have green apple. Good silly sense sand Crayola sand that smells like green apple right here. We got some. We got box kinetic sand. We're already going to the town. Owen, we have a dinosaur container. And inside a dinosaur container, what do we got, Owen? Show them what we got. That's a Triceratops. Yeah. A Pachycephalosaurus. Uh, why there's pink versions? Pachycephalosaurus. Ah, uh, looks like a T-Rex. A pink T-Rex. A silver Ankylosaurus. Some bright ones. A big purple Allosaurus. Stegosaurus. Brachiosaurus. And then look at us. We got Gavin. We got. We got a. We got a tube. Two full of fossils. Just dump it on out. Dump it on out. Show, show them what we got. Look at that. This one is a Look at these fossil. fossils. These are dinosaur fossils. Uh, the fish. 
fish. Look, we had a, a scorpion. Well, is it a brachiopod there? Yeah, and that's a fish. That and look, we got another kinetic sand. Pow! Another kinetic sand. Yeah. And then we got some brushes and a scoop. So what do you think we're gonna make? What are you making, guys, with all this stuff? Do you know, Owen? We are making a sensory box, but dinosaur edition. Dinosaurs? Dinosaurs. So we're making a dinosaur sensory box. Let's open it. So what we're going to do, we're going to bury some fossils, because fossils go underneath the, under the ground, right? Yes. Put a couple fossils in there. We're going to bury the fossils up. All right. You like those? All right. And one more. OK. Split. Good. Split. All right, so we got our fossils in the bottom here. And then we're gonna bury them, right? Yeah. Okay. All right, so look, we got the fossils down here. Oh, and you still got the dinosaurs. You got the top part. Gavin got the bottom part filled. So next, what we're gonna do is we're gonna bury them. So uh, Daddy already cut it open. Why don't you grab some of this kinetic sand out? And let's make sure to remind them to make sure they uh, do what? Um, watch the videos. Yeah. Watch the videos and hit that like button. All right, and, and, and subscribe down here and that'd be awesome. All right, all right. Or, we'll turn Owen into a crazy monster face. Yeah. So hit that, hit that subscribe button. Okay, here we go. Gavin's gonna dump the kinetic sand and we're gonna bury those fossils. There we go, oh man. Now you know what's cool about kinetic sand? Look at this. I'm gonna tear off a piece. Look how cool that is, kinetic sand. Here, you're gonna take a piece and then look, we're just gonna let it fall. Look at that. Oh man, that's so much fun to play with. Here comes Owen, he said, give me some of that. Bury the fossils. Let's bury those fossils. Wait, we have to put it like that. All right, smooth all this out and let's pack it all in there. Gavin's gonna pack it. You can scrape it in. Let's see, are they all, all the fossils are buried? It's the all right, good job, good job, good job. All right, so all the fossils are buried deep in our sand. Hey, so this is a Triceratops. It's a miniature Triceratops sandbox. Okay, let's see what this, this is supposed to, oh my goodness, smell that. Smell that too. What does it smell like? It smells like crazy apple. All right, Owen says he wants to put some green here. There's so much fun in All here right, I want to put some green in here. Well, 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 okay, well, well, well. there's some green. Well, well. This is gonna be our grass, right? So sprinkle some grass, like little, little parts. Like, you know, we'll keep some of the beach and ground but you can design it, make it pretty. Floor, oh, it's packing we again. the floor, the floor yeah. is a mess. Yeah, we're getting messy with this one. All right, so we did some sprinkling. You know what we're gonna do now? Let's put some dinosaurs in here. You wanna set some dinosaurs in here and Gavin will help finish it off? Oh yeah, the T-Rex. T-Rex, all righty. That's a pink T-Rex. All right, this tree right here. Uh, Owen has a tree. Look, we're gonna put a tree right here. Squeeze it in there. Where do you want the other tree at, Owen? I'm a dinosaur. Look at that. That it's was pretty quick. So That's a dinosaur sensory box. Yeah. Let's look at this. It's like a miniature sandbox. So it's called a sensory bin. And a sensory bin is a self-contained tactile play experience. Sensory bins allow children to explore, learn, and create while engaging their senses and having fun. Oh, from just playing this little sandbox? Is that cool or what, man? What? Yeah. So right now, what are you doing? Finding fossils. That's right. So all the dinosaurs are like, oh, no, no, no. We're having fun. We're eating. Oh, no. We're getting extinct. All right. They're leaving. Let's take the dinosaurs away. All righty. Here they go. Dinosaurs are disappearing. Oh no. The dinosaurs are all gone. So what happened? There's only tr So what do you think, Gavin? What happened to the dinosaurs? Maybe they became fossils. Dig. Let's dig them out. Time for the big scoop. I see something. What you got? Here, let's dig in here. Owen, you wanna dig in here? And let's see. Let's see if we can dig up fossils. Oh man. What's that right there? Sim. Get the brush. Brush it away. Let's see. Um, dinosaur. Whoa. <gasps> oh, no. What is that? I think it's a dinosaur tooth. Look at the dinosaur tooth. Here we go. There it is. Grab the dinosaur tooth. 
Whoa, we got a first fossil. That's a Velociraptor crawl, isn't it? That definitely is. All right, here you go. Gavin's working on some more fossils, don't we think? Yeah, what'd you get? What'd you get out of your fossil? More daddy. Looks like a crab. Gavin's cleaning it up. A shovel. Oh, Let's see if we can yeah. dig in here. Look at this dinosaur terrain. Not... That oh, is a brachiopod, and Owen found a fish at the bottom. Man, I think we found. Did we find them all? <gasps> oh my goodness! And a giant T Rex footprint. And then you know what's fun about this? You can just keep playing. Go ahead and have fun. Play with it however you want. You got the whole dinosaurs. But that is how you make a quick sensory bin dinosaur edition. Dinosaur edition! Let's get out. Ugh. Let's see the others. Yeah, that's what's on my daughters. Oh, wait a minute. Ooh. Ooh. Our sensory box is completely torn apart. But you know what's great about these boxes? Yeah. We can build a new one. Do all kind of fun stuff, right? Yep. All right. Well, till yep. next time. Hit, hit that like button. Subscribe our video. Bye. It's the girls like who. Ah! Where is shit? Oh. I have a lot. I'm gonna drill in here, it's my own stick. Can I have more toes? So we need a line right here. Whoa, it's like an egg cracker. Shawling time. It looks like a lollipop. I like to see like a nail. It's not real nail. If I do it more, it will break more. Are you ready for this? I see crap. Need a shawl.
小狗啊，小狗，小狗。Hey guys, what are you all doing over there? Cookies! Cookies? What do we got here? We're making cookies? Yeah! We're making cookies for a dinosaur party. How many more sleeps to our dinosaur party? One more sleep. All right, so a dinosaur party's tomorrow? Yep. All right, well, can I hang out and watch you make some cookies? Yeah. All right, let's do it. What do we do first? We wash our hands. No, let's wash our hands. We already washed our hands. All right, gotta keep and your hands clean. Okay, we, we got some basic yummy ingredients here. All right, mommy's looking at baking instructions. Mommy, All right. First, we have to preheat the oven to 375 degrees. First. Next, we cream the butter, sugar, eggs, and vanilla. Okay, the butter. For the butter. The butter is right here. Oh, yeah, buddy. Look at that. Right. Melted butter. All right. This is going to be a lot of greediness. All righty. Let's see what's got. Let's see. All right. The next we'll do are the eggs. There you go. Act and then we'll get all the shells out. Look. That looks... Oh. One-handed? What? One-handed. Egg cracker? How'd you become so good at cracking some eggs? Are you a professional egg cracker? Have you been baking with mommy? What? What? Next! Next you gotta wash your hands again because you just touched raw eggs. Alright. Look at my hat! The hat? Let's see your hat. It's a dinosaur hat. And you got a dinosaur shirt. Pretty cool, man. Alright, are you pulling your chair over to wash your hands? Now pour the eggs in. All right, now let's see. You got eggs and butter. Let's get it going, man. I want to see what kind of cookies we're making. Now we need one cup of sugar. The that sugar's here. Bad. Let's go with. There you go. That might taste bad. Mommy, this is this salt. This is sugar. All right. Got some sugar in there, man. I can't wait to stir that up. Yeah, me too. Pour it in. We need three of these. Okay. One, two, three. Well, look at that sugar. Look at that. What kind of recipes are you looking over here? Let's see this thing. This is. Uh oh, this. This is grandma's sugar cookie recipe. This is grandma's sugar cookie recipe. Now. While that's beating, we'll mix our dry ingredients. That's easy water. All right, three and a half cups of flour. That's a lot of flour, man. We're gonna mix all our dry ingredients together. And what's that, two teaspoons of baking powder. Two. All right, let's see what's next on the recipe. Our final ingredients is some salt. All right. Okay to make a mess when you're cooking. How's it doing, man? We got, oh yeah. Starting to look like cookie dough to me, huh? Finishing it up? Whoa. Looks like it's finished up to me. Alrighty. Okay. Let's get all the dough back in the bowl. Yeah. And good thing. What you got there, Gavin? What are you holding there? Oh, is that gonna roll it out? Yeah. Let me find some dinosaur cookie cutters. I'll be back. 
All right, guys. Hey, check this out. I was in our holiday baking supplies, and look what I found. What? Look what I found. Stegosaurus. And look what else I found. A T-Rex. A T-Rex. And then check this out. We found an egg. It's going to be a dinosaur egg. Perfect. All right. That's going to look good, I think. Here we go. Time for messy hands. Time for messy hands? Show me how it's done, bud. I'm gonna be the official taste tester. We wanna see how these dinosaur cookies work. Oh my goodness, that's a good amount right there. All right, let's roll it up. All right, rolling it out. What's your favorite dinosaur? Um, everyone. Everyone. You know my favorite one is? What? Stegosaurus. I think I'm gonna roll some out over here too. Like we got a T-Rex and a Stegosaurus. And then an egg, and we're just gonna have a bunch of those, huh? There we go, looks good. Hell, all right. Hey Gavin. What? What do you call a dinosaur that never gives up? A try, 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 triceratops. Hey Gavin. What? what do you call a dinosaur who's no a noisy sleeper? Um. A Tyrannosaurus. A Tyrannosaurus. Tyrannosaurus. Let's do another one. Oh man, you loving it? Ask him if that was a dad joke. Not a bad joke. Oh, bad joke and bad <laughs> joke. Okay, all right. All right, guys, I think I found some cool dinosaur sprinkles. You got green. Mom, look. And then. Mom, look, I made Rockosaurus. Oh, oh, yeah. Hey, what about some purple? Purple's fine. And then blue, got some blues, fine. Well, purple, green, and blue. So there's sprinkles for you, and you finishing them up. And Gavin, yeah, let me see, let me see your lips. What do you got on your lips there? I think he's testing out the sugar already. Oh man, you know what? You think that's enough sugar? All right, we had to clean. We had to do a clean up on aisle six because Gavin was gonna give somebody a sugar overdose. What do you think, Gavin? It's dope. Yeah, that one's a good one for you. Purple. Give me the balls. Oh, you want the green balls? There you go, sir. Mommy's over here, knocking it out. Some blue, making the eggs blue. A little blue stegosaurus. It's a cooking contest. It's a decorating contest. Oh man. Looking good. Uh oh. Hey buddy. Where where do you come from? Oh, he's going to run around. Owen's made an appearance and he's running around. He was taking a, oh my goodness. He just woke up and is doing <laughs> laps. What's going on? How many laps we doing? Oh my goodness. Hey man. Cookies, cookies are gonna go in the oven. All right, Gavin's helping. This is where you gotta let an adult. Seven minutes. Set the timer. All right, what do we got here? Let's see. Let's see. Oh, man. Look at them. All right, we're gonna wait for them to cook up. Oh, man, look how bright those are. Dinosaur cookies. Let's see, right, look at that. Eggs and stegosaurus. All decorated by Gavin. And what do you think? Our taste testers? What do you think? Yummy? Owen? He says good. All right, hey, we'll put our family sugar cookie recipe in the description if you'd like to try them out, because they're good, right? Right, all right, daddy's gonna have one. All right, let me try this out. It's the go play crew. Hey, guys. What? What do you think today is? Mystery craft. It's a mystery craft day. How'd you know that? All right, let's see what we got for today's craft. 
Owen says, open it up. What is it? Dinosaur soap. Dinosaur soap lab. Alrighty, let's check it out. Dinosaur soap lab, do it yourself. Science and fun go hand in hand in this kit. We're gonna make soap. It says six soaps, three dinosaur models, and four colors. Let's do it. Why don't you open that while I see the instructions? It says, are you a dinosaur fan? No. No? You're a dinosaur fan. No, you dinosaur fan. We're both dinosaur fans. Are you a dinosaur fan? All right, we love dinosaurs. If you are, what would be more fun than making your own dino soaps? Let's open it. All right, I'm going to hand them to you. That looks like our dinosaur molds. And maybe that's our soap stuff. A little mixing beaker. Our instructions. That smells. Ooh, that smells good. We're gonna have good smelling soap. Oh, smell it. Looks like we have some stir sticks and some glitter. And color. some colors and some some scents. Lemon and green apple fragrance. This is gonna be smelly, glittery, colorful hey, dinosaur soap. Dinosaurs. Well, we gotta make it. Let's see how we do it. We have a nice smelly lemon to make. You'll smell like lemon when you use this soap, but we'll set this here. Let's see. Green apple. And we've got this color. Yeah. And then we have this color. Red. And then we have this color. Blue. And we have that color. Green. All right. This is our soap base. And then, look, we got some glitter in here. Let's go ahead and open that. Our mixing sticks. Let's set that here. And we'll set the knife here. Let's see what kind of dinosaurs we have. All right. This looks like our base. Let's set that there. And here are our dinosaur molds. All right. Can you help me? And our beaker. Little dish here. Let's put the block in. And it says, ask an adult to put the put it in the microwave. So we have to heat it up for just about 10, 15 seconds to get it soft. So let's put it in here. And 15 seconds. All right. All right, it's all melted. Look at that. Oh, oh. Yeah. So now, oh, it's hot. You don't want to touch it. That's why you have to have an adult do this part. Take little chunks out. Let's pour it in the beaker. All right. Beaker, beaker, poop. We had three drops of liquid color of your choice. What color do you want to make your first soap? A dinosaur frog. I know. What color do you want to make it? Owen's got the green. Or if you want red, blue, or yellow, which color do you want? Red. Red. Let's open it up. All right. Three drops. One. Two. All right. Three. Now you got to stir it up again. Stir that color in there. That's cool. Stay red. Getting the whole thing red. Then it says... You can add a fragrance if you want. You want to try green apple? You like green apple? Keep staring that up and I'll open this for you. All right. So, Go ahead. Squeeze the black part. All right. Some green apples in there, good. Keep stirring that up. And you want some glitter in it? You want a red glitter one? All right, let that open up. Just, just take a little sprinkle. Just, all right, stir it all in there. That looks great. Let's see. Here's the working tray. What dinosaur you want? Pick out your dinosaur. We got a Stegosaurus. T-Rex. The old T-Rex. King of the dinosaurs. So make sure this is all tight. And you'll have to let daddy do this part. And he's the molds there. Then we have to carefully pour the mixture. It says we have to wait for at least 45 minutes to cool. You know what we're going to do with this? Yeah. To speed it along, we're going to set this in the refrigerator real quick. Okay. And it'll make it cool, cool quicker. Okay. Alright, so put the tricerotops in. Alright, thank you, Owen. 
And now you can hold the Stegosaurus. Hey, well, we gotta add some color and glitter. Oh, I got good. So, I'm, I'm, you gonna do the, some, add some yellow to this? Yeah, because the only one's yellow. Okay, Owen said he likes yellow. Here, let me help you with that. Thanks. You're welcome. I got, I got All right, this. squirt it in there. All right, stir it up. <laughs> Go ahead, get that yellow in there. What do you got over here? We'll do the stegosaurus next for you. All right. We got a little orange. We got an orange dinosaur this time. Yeah. Because we got some red and yellow. All right, let daddy do this part because remember, it's, it's hot. So are you ready? Yeah. Let's pour it in. Let's watch it. All the way up. Look at that. All righty, let's set him here and get him hardening up. It's gonna look cool. Now that he's Stegosaurus black. We'll do one more. So we're gonna do green for the Stegosaurus. Sounds good. You hold the stick for us. Thank you. Yep, now we're gonna melt this one again. For a quick 10, 15 seconds. Are you kidding me? Okay, we're done. Let's see. All right, there we go. We put it in here. Okay, so you said we're gonna do green. So there you go, I'll open it for you. Squirt some green in there. I know I got One more. One more. Oh yeah, that's good. There you go. Alrighty, let's get the green. Go ahead and stir that up. That's gonna be pretty bright green. And we'll put a dash of glitter in here for you. Oh. And then do you want lemon or a green apple? Here, just a little bit. Okay, there you go. Stir it up. You want green apple or lemon? Green apple. Green apple, okay. Let's add a little green apple. There you go, squirt it in there. One more, you see that go in there? Let's smell it. Mm. Smells like green apple, stir that up. Smell that, green apple? Whoa. Whoa. I'm, I'm pouring. Did you get it all stirred up good? That's gonna I'm be, pouring. That's going to be such an awesome green. I'm, I'm not pouring. You want to pour it in? Yeah. All right, let's see if we can do it. Just a second. And slowly, scoot it back. There you go. Slowly. Good job. Look at it fill up. You're doing a great job on your own. All the way up. Good job, buddy. All right. Let's top off a little. All right. Good job. That's going to be an awesome green stegosaurus. I think it's ready. So I'm going to slowly open it and see what we got. Let's open this mold. It said carefully open it. Oh my goodness. Let's get this side. All right. You said careful. It's hard. All right. Let me, let me peel it this way. Wow. This is going to be soap you're going to use in the bathtub. Is it almost out? Pow! All right, now to make it perfect, this is what we do. It's got some pieces of mold around it. So what we do is we take this tool. And I'll cut, cut the, and you cut it. So I'll cut this base. cut the mold. Yeah, I'll cut this base, the tight part off, see? And then we'll put this in for extra. And now you can cut around and see, cut that extra off. Oh, it's gonna be so cool. So go ahead, you cut the extra off. And while you're doing that, let's learn about the Tyrannosaurus. You go ahead and cut, and I'll read what this says. Hey, okay, look, the colorful T-Rex in right there, right there, right I know, that's cool. So go ahead and cut all that extra off, and we'll learn about the Tyrannosaurus. It's one of the largest and most fearsome dinosaurs. It had a mouthful of 60 teeth, each one almost eight inches long. Its massive jaws gave it a bite three times stronger than a lion, and scientists believe it could eat 500 pounds of meat in one bite. That's more than you can eat in a year. As you can imagine, it's it's, plants. that's right. We'll get to, he's a plant eater. You're so smart. You're correct. And we'll get to him since we finish this guy up. 
As you can imagine, the Tyrannosaurus was a vicious hunter and feasted on smaller animals. Many fossils show marks of its teeth on bones that have been completely bitten through. It probably had an excellent sense of smell as skull fossils show it a large area for that part of the brain. Once it smelled something to eat, live or dead, it would have no problem scaring away other scavengers who would try to share. That's all about the Tyrannosaurus. Let's finish up a little bit here. Look, we'll cut a little bit off that. Shave it. You did a good job. Shave a little bit of the head. Oh man, this this is gonna be so much fun. There's his Daddy. arm. Daddy. And then this part right here. Gone. Are we good? Mm -hmm. Let's look. Look at this. T-Rex glitter soap. Let's get the arms out. Got the stegosaurus mold. I'll peel it off and I'll let you trim it up. All right? And Here we go. Yeah, I'm gonna part. All right, there's that part. Wow. I'm gonna peel it Look at that. Oh, there it is. All right, go ahead and pull them out. Whoa! All right, take the tool. Here, it'd be easier to set them on the table. Here, I'll cut the big pipe off. We got a lot there. And then you trim them up. All right, trim them up all fancy. We'll put the extra here. All right, so while you do that, thank you, buddy. I was helping me get my phone. All right, did you trim, you, did, you clean them up that quick? Well, there's a Stegosaurus. Right there. All right, you hold it and check it out. Right there. This curious creature had large bony pointy plates sticking right into the air along the length of its back, which may look to you like they are helpful as protection, but fossils show us that these plates were attached to the skin, not the skeleton. They would sort of bend if pushed. They were probably a cooling system. Extra space on the skin surface allowing heat to leave the body more quickly. But this bus sized slow moving plant eater wasn't without its defenses. It could swing a spiked tail at anything getting too close. It would have some trouble planning its day, though, as it had a brain the size of a plum. All right, Gavin, and when I saw this, I thought this was a Triceratops. Mm -hmm. It's actually a oh, Storacosaurus. So we're gonna have to learn about the Storacosaurus because look, it only has one horn. Yeah, you know how three horns. Three right? horns is a tri, that's right. A tri. Okay, let's open this up. Oh, look at that. Look at that one. Let's peel it out. All right, go ahead and grab them. Peel. Wow. Oh, that's a little bit bigger. Look at that. Yeah, that's a little bit bigger. You trim all the excess off. Make them look good. I'm gonna... you, you go ahead and do all that. And I'm, we're going to learn about the Storacosaurus while you do that. The Storacosaurus, this plant eater's naming Spike Lizard one of the most unique looking dinosaurs. It was the size of a tank and looked kind of like a horned rhinoceros with a giant flat triangular head and six spikes sticking out of its back. They lived in what is today North America and traveled in herds, which gave them added protection as they could fight larger enemies as a group. Fossils show us they probably laid eggs in nests and stayed close to them like birds until they hatched. I know how to do it. All right, let me help you out. Let's see. The soap's pretty easy because it's still pretty soft. So we're going to cut. Yeah, extra. Let's do it. Cut here. Look at that. Right there. Up oh, and then the pipe here. Gone. And then I'll clean all this up because we can, we're going to reuse this for our last dinosaur. The T Rex. Stegosaurus. Bogosaurus. And a Storacosaurus. That's a T-Rex. You're right. There are in T-Rex. Yep. Yeah. And the Blue You're right. Go ahead and trim him up. You know what? While you're doing that, I'm going to get the Storacosaurus out. And I'll trim him up and we got a bunch of soap. Wow. Oh, you got some over there. Get those edges. Let's see. Shave there. And a little on the tail. And guess what? Perfect. Go ahead and set them with their other pack of dinosaurs. I have one right here. 
Awesome. Just for now. Just for now, boy. I'm excited. To... I'm All right. very excited. Yeah. Let's hope we have left so we don't waste okay. anything. We're going to try to make a rainbow stegosaurus. So let's... Uh-oh. Hey, there we go. Let's put there a little last bit of red here. Rainbow stegosaurus, but you gotta wait for each color to cool. Okay. Peel them off. I didn't get this. Good job. Put that in our extras. It's so cold. Drop it in our extras and we'll save it. Yep. All right, peel them off. It's wow. so cold, Dad. I know. Is that cool? <coughs> there it is. A red Styracosaurus. Set them with our dinosaur collection. Pretty cool. All right, so we used the leftovers to make a stegosaurus, because we have one, two of each now. And let's see how this rainbow stegosaurus turned out. So let's peel it off. So it's one stegosaurus. That's wow. You get the train. Wow. Right. Cutting that piece off. And under his tail. think we have check it out Gavin what? look at that uh, it's called hey. rainbow stegosaurus want to sit him with your rest of them uh -huh. I play on you no, know there's two right. there's two each you're right it's the go play crew hey guys come join the go play crew and subscribe to our channel and if you could like and share our videos, that would be awesome. Now let's go play.